Welcome back. So here's what I plan on doing today. As I mentioned at the end of last episode, I want to do the, uh, I'll make a little reed farm and kind of shape the edges of this island a little bit. Uh, at least right over here. I think the back I'm just going to leave the way it is. Just leave it wild back here. So I planned on, I originally planned on throwing a reed farm over there, but I figured, you know what, that, that might be a little bit too far away. Mm, I'll just put it right in here. So I'll I'll uh, dig all this out, this dirt, down to the bottom layer, make some channels going back, and just plant reed all around it. And I might throw some on this side too. So make it look like you're walking through a little reed, uh, a little reed pathway to get on here. Uh, I'm definitely going to build the thing today, the uh, the tiki hut slash gazebo could throw it right down there and then I'll finish this deck walkway and then throw some trees down and pretty much this island will be done all right so this tree is probably gonna have to go and I don't like that anyway this this tree grew back when that uh bug was happening with the uh, hovering trees or something and uh, uh, the, the four base trees always grew with this um, this little piece missing. So this one has to get cut down anyway, and it, it's in the way right now. But I'm figuring about right here. How many channels would that give me if I just dig straight down from right here? One, two, three, four. Yeah, that's definitely enough. So that'll be eight channels. Let me cut this thing down. Oh, I don't have to get up there and break that too. That gets annoying. I uh, harvested all my crops off camera. A lot of what's growing isn't, it's probably overgrown. Let's see, we're in, yeah, we're in June, and those crops were planted last year. So this is like their second summer. I think if you don't harvest them in time, they just, uh, they kind of die. But I did get a lot out of it, so. I didn't rotate them and plant them again though. No. I guess I'll just wait to do that later. I wanted to get started on this. I'm figuring this could probably go all the way back. And I'll probably have a little stairway like right here just to get down. Yeah, so I'll just cut this for now. I'll dig this out for now. Okay. Nope. Oh, still got two lays to go. Yeah, so it's going to be a lot of dirt moving. I have uh, other shovels. I'm going to have to whip up a batch of blue steel soon. Because I'm running low on tools. I think I have enough silver for a couple ingots. Yeah, I should have enough silver for quite a few ingots of blue steel. And it's going to be back to mining uh, after that, because well, those tools will last for a while, but yeah, I'm running low on the uh, ingredients I need for, for higher tier metals. Okay. So here's what it looks like, the channels. Uh, I got the water flowing in this one. Not, I didn't really finish this one yet. I got to do that back wall. But basically, the reed is going to grow down here. And I went with flowing water, so if I miss any, it would just, the reed would just flow into this bottom channel and it would flow to one side where I could just pick it up in one spot. These bottom channels aren't flowing right 
right now for some reason. I think it's because I'm using the wooden buckets instead of uh, moving source blocks. So that's just kind of disabled for now, but it's, it's there when I uh, when I get a, a red bucket and I can move water. There's this side. That's what it looks like. Same thing. It all floats in the middle, and then uh, the middle channel will push it to one spot. So I just go pick that up. I made some andesite bricks here, so figured I would do this with the back wall. Because I just don't like the uh, these dirt walls like that. It just doesn't look right. So now it looks like it's kind of shaped. I don't need this. So it's it's shaped and being held back by the stone. Don't want to put too much stone up because don't want to change the island. But a little bit here and there, it's, it looks cool. stack inside but check this out there's a funny little bug yeah it freezes now you could break it oh well if you don't break it it'll do that but if you do that and break it then it's normal uh, I don't know if that has any uh, it doesn't have anything to do with the temperature 31 Celsius that's definitely not freezing just seems to do, I guess just a bug does that. If you leave it, it will turn into that solid block like that. And you can update that if you want. And then you got your flowing water. Just a weird thing. Alright, yeah, middle channel. It's not going to work right now. Alright, let me go grab my reed and we'll plant this stuff up. Alright, so I come back here. I went and grabbed my reed. I came back and I noticed my rice plants are all uh, looking like they need to be harvested. And I was just in there about 10 minutes ago and I picked everything. And everything I left wasn't able to be harvested, and I just went in there, and now these rice plants are, are ready to go. So that's weird. I guess they don't they don't die. I get, if you leave them there too long, I guess they'll come back when they're in season again. I don't really understand, but uh, some of my crops are uh, ready to be picked, and they weren't about 10 minutes ago. Anyway, I'll go harvest that later. Let's throw the reed down. Probably ain't even gonna be enough. I just grabbed a stack of 64, but I don't have to fill in. Oh, this is one of those things where you can't even jump out. All right, this could be a problem. Wow, seriously? That that messes up the whole channel. Oh well, that that'll just stay like that for now. This holds a lot of reed. One stack of 64 isn't going to be enough. Alright, let's get some on this side. So at least we get the effect of walking through growing reed like that. Alright, I'll just I'll finish planting them as they grow. 
All right, so what else can I do here before I get to that? Uh, I guess just shape this up a little bit. Instead of having dirt just stick out everywhere. Uh, I could make this come out. Yeah. I'll fix this. No, I don't need a spot there. Now we could have deck that comes straight out into there. Yeah, I know this looks funny here. These chests obviously aren't staying here. I had to dig under them. I do have slate on me. Good. So I can make stairs. Only 14, though. Did I bring any more rocks so I can make more bricks? I did. Okay. So I'll just make the stairs out of slate as I did and everything else on this deck. There we go throw down the stairs over here all right that looks cool it's coming along actually you know what I don't really like how high this is right here I might I might lower that to down there and then have this stair going up over here. Yeah, I'm going to do that. So I'll do that. And yeah, I guess it's time to build this. Let's let's knock this out. So let me get rid of this stuff. I don't need this. I'm going to need the chestnut and Kapok. Oh yeah, I'm going to need these planks for the ceiling. Or the roof, really. Alright, so since uh, I built this already, I built a bunch of these already, you've seen me build them. I will just make a cutscene and add it to music. And we'll get this built.
Alright, so it doesn't quite look exactly like the old ones with the with this little bit of change here. But definitely without the trunk in the middle. No glass, and I went with these posts here instead of the solid wall. Because this is supposed to be like a just chilling out in nature type thing. And this is open right here because it's going to be pretty much this. And over here too. There's so actually a lot of room in here without that 4x4 four four tree right in the middle. Yeah, so this is it. So now I can make this extend into here, like this. <laughs> Would have been nicer if it lined up with this one, but oh well. No big deal. I used to like this hickory wood a lot, and I still do, but chestnut, definitely the best type of wood in this game. That is, it's just awesome. Alright. Now over here, I'm going to have a little, kind of like a little trail going to this thing, I guess. This isn't to play around on, though. This is just for, uh, that's all business. Maybe um, I'll do like if I make this all wood here. Like you could come out on this side, but you're not supposed to be going walking around over here. What would that look like? That kind of looks dumb. What if I just make it go like this? And I made some more slate bricks because I need more stairs. chisel I guess I gotta put a piece of wood there so it looks a little bit better all right let me sleep um, lay down some torches here we'll lay down the trees and it might be done Alright, so let's start the lighting from over here. Now, I guess the most obvious thing to do would just be this. There's no pattern here. I'm just randomly throwing them down. So now this walkway has some light. I might, I might just be able to put them right on here because this is three wide. I'll think about that later. I fixed this, by the way. So now it's only one step up here, then two steps up here. It looks a lot better. That definitely looks better. Alright, so these I could just throw down. Right, definitely get them in the corners here. Alright, throw one right here, so this path is well lit. Yeah, 
Yeah, we don't have to light the whole entire island. This, uh, because this is just, it's not enclosed, so I'm never going to have every mob stop spawning around here. And they're just going to walk right into my place if they do anyway. It's kind of a, uh, something I never looked forward, looked into the future of doing when I settled in this place was having some fencing the whole area off pretty much and having a sanctuary. I pretty much can't do that now. It's just too big and odd shaped this whole area. Anyway, got some trees on me, got my sequoias. I'd rather plant them here and have them grow, so hopefully the little trees won't grow out of control here. Uh, there's really not much room for these big guys anymore. If we throw one right here. Sure, right there, why not? Oh yeah, we need one over here. Definitely. Yeah. Bang, right there. It's a perfect spot for one. Hmm. I don't think one would grow if I just threw it down right here. But I'll throw one anyway, see what happens. And you know what? Let's get one growing down here. Look at this nice little spot here for a tree. Perfect. You get out of here. Right here? Maybe? Sure, why not? I'm going to move that one over here. Alright, we'll see what happens with that. Uh, hmm. I get my stuff out of here so we could get a final look at what it, the island by itself and finish planting these reeds. A lot of them, they're pretty much all grown here. I should be able to fill it all in now. So let me do that. Clean this place up. We'll get a look at it. And we're pretty much done. Maybe I, if I put... Can I put a torch on? I can't put a torch on there. I, I In here I need some light. Pretty much, that's what I'm saying. So I guess I could just do this to light up on the inside here. Yeah, that should be good. We'll see what it looks like at night, too. So here's the place at night. It's pretty lit up, I gotta say. It's about as lit up as I wanted it to be. Oh, oh crap, I'm getting out of here. I wanted to do this before it got too crazy out, but that ain't gonna happen. Oh, man, you gotta make it difficult. Alright, so I, I finished filling in this stuff. The reed. And I think it would be a good idea to throw up some trees. Oh, God, this is so annoying. I can't get out of here now. I mean, not not trees here. It would be a good idea to throw up some torches on here because this is three wide, so it doesn't really. It's not taken away from any space away from here. There. We don't really need them right here because we've got these going. Alright, so that's that little island. And there's a little bit of time left. So what I want to do is head over to the tree farm and get my green apple in the ground over there. And get that thing going. I got plums. Are they gonna come down? I never harvested these before. I missed, I missed them last season. Crap. Oh, there we go. Yeah, they're plums. I didn't name this tree. Nothing else is blooming. All right. So up here, kind of got a little overgrown up here. This was supposed to be all tree farm, but I never did find any new trees. 
This green apple one is the, the closest only Nutra I found in like months. So I'm just going to make it the same way as it is down there. And I'll just plant them right here. Oh, I got rows of three. Three seems to be enough. Unless you really want to go overkill with it. So over here would be the uh, the walkway, which I'm going to make out of my new favorite piece of wood, chestnut. They got they had to have done something, because I keep doing that. Like that, and I keep throwing down a tool or whatever it is I'm dropping in my inventory. I don't know, I'm not going to go crazy over it. Uh, okay, and I only have two of them, so I can't even plant three or or more than three if I wanted to. That's driving me crazy, by the way. I keep throwing stuff down like that. Alright, that should go right there. I think. No. No, it doesn't go right there. Ah! Oh! You can't do that, I forgot. It's been so long since I messed with fruit trees. It should go right here. Alright, well now I'm down to one. And I'm not going to do this whole thing now, just this area around my new single green apple tree now. Fence this off like this. Just, I just happen to have chert cobblestone laying around from uh, just from a while ago actually just from creeper explosions and I might as well just do the whole thing with sand like the other one surround it with sand just to keep the overgrowth down sand here. There you go, I got a green apple tree. I don't know how this if this farm is going to go, if they're going to go down that way or straight out this way. But I only got one, so that doesn't matter. It's going right there name this one. See? See? I keep doing that. They had to have changed something. It's driving me mad, I swear. This is good for right now. Green. Apple. I don't have the right tree. I know it's a tree. Alright, there we go. And you know what? I never named this one so I might as well why should I throw this sign I'll just put it back here Oh, right. We're pretty much done. That is it. That's it for today. That island is finally developed, which is cool. That was a mess I was tired of looking at. So now it's got some use. And I'm going to pick my plums. Thanks for joining me, and come back next time. See you then. Later.